Varkari or Warkari meaning a pilgrim is a sampradaya religious movement within the bhakti spiritual tradition of Vaishnavite Hinduism geographically associated with the Indian state of Maharashtra Varkaras worship Vithal also known as Vithoba the presiding deity of Pandharpur regarded as a form of Krishna Saints and gurus of the Bhakti movement associated with the Varkaras include Jnanasvar, Namdev, Chokamela, Eknath, and Tukaram, all of whom are accorded the title of San. The Varkari movement includes the worship Vithoba and a duty-based approach towards life emphasizing moral behavior and strict avoidance of alcohol and tobacco, the adoption of a strict lacto-vegetarian diet and fasting on Ekadashi day twice a month, self-restraint, brahmacharya during student life, equality and humanity for all rejecting discrimination based on the caste system or wealth, the reading of Hindu texts, the recitation of the Harapath every day and the regular practice practice of bhajan and kirtan. Topic. Influence The Varkari tradition has been part of Hindu culture in Maharashtra since the 13th century CE, when it formed as a panth community of people with shared spiritual beliefs and practices during the Bhakti movement. Varkaras recognize around 50 poet saints sants, whose works over a period of 500 years were documented in an 18th century hagiography by Mahipati. The Varkari tradition regards these sants to have a common spiritual line of descent. Varkaras look upon God as the ultimate truth and ascertained grades of values in social life but accepted ultimate equality among men. Varkaras bow in front of each other because everybody is Brahma, and stressed individual sacrifice, forgiveness, simplicity, peaceful co-existence, compassion, non-violence, love and humility in social life. The Varkari poets put God-realization in simple terms in small booklets of verse. Each saint extolled Japa, chanting the Lord's name. Dnyaneshwar, Namdev, Eknath, Tukaram, Santaji Jagnade, and other Marathi Bhakti saints of the sect tried to mold the attitude of the common people, which included low castes and women, to have a kind of detachment and the courage of one's convictions in the face of evil forces. Topic. Pilgrimages Varkari people undertake an annual pilgrimage Vari to Pandharpur, gathering there on Ekadashi the 11th day of the Hindu lunar calendar month of Ashada, corresponding to a date falling sometime between late June to July in the Gregorian calendar. Pilgrims carry palki of the saints from their places of samadhi enlightenment or spiritual birth. The tradition of carrying the paduka sandals of the sants in a palki was started by the youngest son of Tukaram, Narayan Maharaj, in 1685. Further changes were brought to the pilgrimage by descendants of Tukaram in the 1820s and by Haybatrav Baba, a courtier of the Sindhyas and devotee of Dnyaneshwar. Devotees of Vithal were holding pilgrimages prior to the 14th century. In the present day, about 40 Palkis and their devotees from all over Maharashtra do so. Another pilgrimage is celebrated on the Ekadashi of the month of Kartika, which falls in November of the Gregorian calendar. Events such as Ringan and Dava are held during the pilgrimage. During the Ringan, an unmounted sacred horse called Malancha Ashva, who is believed to be the soul of the saint whose idol is being carried in the litter, runs through the rows of pilgrims, who try catching the dust particles kicked off and smear their head with the same. Dava is another kind of race where everyone wins and it is held to commemorate the manner in which Tukaram first saw the temple at Pandharpur and started running in sheer exhilaration. Topic. Lifestyle Varkari wear tulasi mala, a rosary made from osimum tenuiflorum. They are lacto-vegetarians and follow a sattvic diet. Furthermore, like many other Vaishnava sects, they refrain from using onion and garlic in their cooking. Sect members also refrain from intoxicating substances such as alcohol. <laughs> 